Hi everyone, it's a Sunday. I'm starting another vlog, a new vlog. Hopefully you like the previous one because I haven't even posted yet. I'm just about to. But anyway, I am super excited today because for the first time in forever, my husband went with Adele for a walk and I'm home alone. Home alone. Oh my God, it feels so weird uh, to be home alone. But anyway, um, I don't have much time. I have about two hours and I have so much to do. I have to film two videos and get ready. Uh, two videos is quite a lot. If I still have a little bit of time left, I'm going to start editing them, but I'm so excited. These two hours really give me so much time to do the work. If I film two videos now, it means two weeks of uh, content, which is amazing, right? And usually I don't have much time to do that, especially during the daylight. If you go back, if you watch my previous videos, all of them I filmed at night uh, because this is the only time I have the opportunity to. <laughs> but today we're gonna be doing this during the daylight. It's 12.30, I'm very excited. I'm gonna show you how I do my hair because I got this new tool that I shared on my Instagram, not on my YouTube though, just a second. So I got myself this guy, it's from Revlon and I forgot the name, it's a Volumizer Plus or something uh, but it's such a cool little thing that I saw so many reviews on. I saw the reviews on the previous one, the original one. This is a newer style and you can remove um, the top part as you can see. I don't know what for, I don't know what the difference is but you can do that now and it's you know it's pretty lightweight compared to my Dyson Crawl for example and I really love the way it dries my hair so I'm gonna do my makeup also I'm breaking out a lot if you can see and I feel like this is because of a hat so I do put the makeup on every day and then I put on a hat and I feel like it's the Jacques Mousse hat because I wear it a lot and I can see some stains from my foundation and the powder and I know it's so gross and disgusting but I have no other choice. <laughs> I really need to wash the hat now and I feel like this is what basically caused all the breakouts on my forehead uh, which is so annoying. I'm gonna start doing my makeup I think then I'll get dressed and then I'll do my hair and I'll show you um, how I do it basically, but it's super fast, super easy. I am so excited to be home alone. As you can see, this is the layout of my closet right now. So I have this section for Adele and then all of this is hers. And this is pretty much everything she needs. I have a little uh, basket over there with all of her socks and tights and everything. But uh, this is everything she needs right now for her age. And I need to figure out what I want to wear today uh, to film the first video. The first video is gonna be uh, the Celine unboxing. So I have a new bag from Celine. It is hidden over here. So this is my new bag and I haven't shared it yet and I also have to do the giveaway Celine giveaway, uh, Christmas giveaway. By the way, I'm pretty sure that video is already up. I'm gonna link it in the description box up here as well. Make sure to check it out, enter the uh, giveaway. I think I will do it till mid of January. I know everybody started to do this uh, Christmas giveaways away earlier. I'm a little bit late in the game, but simply because I did not have much time. But anyway, I feel like it's still nice to receive a small gift in the middle of January or beginning of February, right? And good luck, I really hope you'll win. Um, but now, I need to choose an outfit. So I have decided to wear a dress for this video, don't mind my home socks, um, but simply because I really, really wanted to um, wear a dress today. I don't know why, it's been so long. It's been since my pregnancy times that I wore a dress. And um, yeah, I got it very recently from H&M. If it's still available, I will link it in the description box. And I put on a t-shirt underneath for layering. And then I also put on my uh, chunky necklace that I got a week ago. And I showed you in my previous vlog as well. Uh, some, you know, gold-plated earrings. And yeah. <laughs> I was going to show you how I do my hair using this um, hair tool. It's, you know, the simplest little thing and I don't do any curls or anything like that. Um, it's just so simple. But first of all, I divide uh, my hair into two 
sections, main sections, the top and the bottom. And I always start with the bottom because obviously. And uh, then I split um, the bottom section in two sections and I just start, you know, brushing through them uh, with uh, this tool. This is how you turn it on. And there are three different modes, even four. The cool one, number one, number two, and number three. I use it on number two. Number three is very strong, I feel like. Number one is not enough. But number two is perfect. And like this, I just go section by section. Anyway, I'm gonna finish um, the bottom part and I will show you the result. I did all the bottom part and as you can see, my hair looks amazing and it is so shiny and it's so soft and it is so nice and it feels amazing. I tried adding a little bit of volume here, but you'll be able to see the end result uh, once I finish the top part. Anyway, I'm gonna do that now. It's already been 30 minutes, so I don't have much time left, so I really have to hurry and start filming um, the main video. So here is the final result. And you know, the result is very subtle. Um, it's nothing crazy. <laughs> there, are, there are no curls or anything like that, but you know, it still looks like I got a blowout at a salon or something. Um, it is so amazing and I love it so much. It looks like you didn't put any effort, but at the same time uh, you did. I immediately look put together and like I am ready to rock this day and I'm indeed ready right now. And I do use some heat protection before, of course. Um, it's very important, you should too if you don't. The very first weekly vlog is finally up on my channel and I'm receiving uh, a few comments from you guys saying that this is the format you actually prefer rather than a sit-down video. I mean, honestly speaking, I love sit-down videos because they are... <laughs> Just so much faster to film you. I'm here with Adele, by the way. <laughs> She's not very happy, but I really need to uh, start <laughs> loading um, all the footage to my computer so I can edit a bit later. But I feel like my work for today is done. I just finished editing the Celine giveaway video, the Celine unboxing and the giveaway all together. It is currently... 1 21 a.m which is so late my husband's asleep already because uh, he has to go to work tomorrow morning uh and i'm going to bed now i'm so tired there is a few things we need to do tomorrow so yeah good night and i'll see you tomorrow bye hi everyone i'm starting this vlog a little bit later in the day it's around 5 p.m. Yeah, 10 to 5. Uh, we are on a Monday and Anel and I were going to get the photos because on Saturday we did go but the shop was closed. They only open from uh, Monday to Friday till 6.30 p.m. So we really need to <laughs> go there now. I also need to pass by the post office uh, to send something for my husband. And uh, yeah, then we need to return his pants uh, the pajama pants that I bought last week. He didn't like the cut <laughs> and I knew that. That's why I got two pairs because he likes the brand but he doesn't like the fit. So yes, I was right. He hated them so I'm gonna go return them.
pants that I'm returning, the pajama, and I'm thinking of getting this one instead. It's so cute with the little bears. Uh, but this is extra large and I need to ask if they have a size small. pajamas for myself since they didn't have the size uh, for my husband I have decided to buy myself some pajamas and uh, ew that's so gross when people cough in public places without wearing a mask um, outside ew she doesn't even cover her mouth how gross I need to stay away from her I'm sorry but like I'm a germaphobe I'm wearing a mask everywhere at all times oh and here's some draw and all of this is on sale. I really love all the sparkle. So beautiful. This I love so much. But this type of heel is a no-no for me. They have more brands here like Kenzo for example which is a nice brand. I used to love it so much back in the day. Then they have a Zatik and Voltaire. The thing is, I've known about this brand for ages, but I never bought anything. I don't know. I feel like it's not really my vibe. They really like everything rock and roll. And I think that's just not me. Oh, then there is self-portrait. And I love all of the styles more than the previous ones they had. Do you remember the lace types of dresses they used to make all the time? I definitely prefer this. It looks more edgy. It is 2 a.m. on a Tuesday. I just finished ironing all the clothes and before that I had to do a little bit of work on my computer and before it was, you know, adult time all the time. <laughs> and now I finally get to relax for a little bit in a complete silence. There is nobody, it's just me and my tea over here before going to sleep. I just, you know, wanted to take a nice break and have this cup of tea. It's very unnecessary at this time. <laughs> I should just go to bed, but you know, I do feel tired, but I really, really need my time, my alone time. Even if it's just like 15, 20 minutes, I need it so bad to kind of like, you know, exhale and let the entire day go and um, reset myself basically, yes. Hi everyone, it is a Tuesday. I'm getting ready to head out. We're going for a walk. I'm wearing my new sweater from uh, Cos, the one that I got on sale, and my new jeans from Cos as well. It's pretty warm outside, it's like 10 degrees. Amazing. We are finally outside. 
uh, went for a walk. We're supposed to go with my husband to walk him uh, to his meeting, but Adele was crying a little bit, and so we stayed under the tree over here so she can fall asleep. She really enjoys looking at all the uh, trees and the leaves and everything, as I said in my previous vlog, and she's just so cute. She finally fell asleep, so we can walk now, but uh, I don't know where we should go. Honestly, there is no plan. Uh, we don't really have anything to do the only thing is that i bought home fragrance um the other day and the thing is they didn't give us new sticks and we really do need to change those sticks so maybe i should pass by the store um, and just get them also the weather is so warm outside it's it is such a beautiful weather today it's a bit cloudy but i love when it's cloudy when it's not sunny to be honest i don't know why and this is the perfect weather for me personally it's like 10 11 degrees and i'm wearing my turtleneck uh my new um leather coat the one that i got from massimo duty um a while back actually i bought it in summer and this is the first time i'm wearing it uh so I'm so happy, you know, with the weather. And also, I've got my Ava bag. I'm wearing it with this coat. This is how I pictured, you know, me using the bag. So I'm just so proud with myself today, with my outfit. I'm loving it so much. And I really want my hubby to take a few pictures maybe afterwards. Um, yeah, we'll see. I feel like I only show you the shops, but I have decided to show you the flower clock that we have. Um, it's uh, in Jardin Anglais, it's right over there. And uh, Christmas market is over there. I shared a few stories on my Instagram of uh, Christmas market, but I don't remember if I filmed a YouTube video on it, to be honest. Then we have this Ferris wheel over here right next to the Mont Blanc bridge and before we used to have it during August season only uh, for the holiday but now I feel like it's here all year round <laughs> Hugging and kissing just you and me Carolers are singing outside our door Lovely songs we all heard before As they walk Clement. and uh, the weather is so beautiful as you can see it is a bit cloudy but I love the skies over there the turquoise slash yellow colors yellow hues we're chasing snowflakes as they're falling down and follow route of all across the town lady with me under the mistletoe while Santa's busy saying ho 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 we're feeling jolly so we came to Wine and Beef, it's my favorite restaurant in Geneva, but I've decided not to sit inside because it's a bit hot. Um, we are here, it's like this pas passage, you know, with uh, a lot of different stores and McDonald's right over here. Adele is sleeping, I've got my salad, so excited to dig in. We are still walking, it's been uh, 3 hours 15 minutes already and she had a little breakdown at the shop but it's okay, we we'll pulled through, uh, she was better and uh, I managed to have lunch which was very nice, it was our very first time uh, you know, going to a restaurant together, just the two of us even with my husband we usually, we usually never go but this time I was just so hungry and I knew she was sleeping um, pretty well so I was like, oh whatever, I'll try my luck, you know, and thank goodness I did 
like she was sleeping the entire time and I ate my most favorite the most delicious beef ever so now we're still walking around I really want to go to Gucci because there is a little uh, bum bag that I really really like I'm gonna post a picture here so you can take a look it's uh, because you can wear it in so many different ways but at the same time they didn't have it in stock last time I went there a few weeks ago I'm not sure if they'll have it now if there is a point of even going um, but I know this bag is available on Louis Via Roma and I'm thinking should I just order it the thing is I want to see it in person I want to try it on and see how it looks on me The other day I showed you the bag with these two boxes inside and I didn't have any patience so I had to open them and so my hubby got me this book this one it is so freaking heavy I cannot even take it out of the box to be honest because it's this heavy and here is the second box <gasps> He got me this Louis Vuitton Virgil Abloh book that I swear I loved so much. And I told him about it, that it was so cool and such a cool gift. And he got me both of them. He knows how much I love all of these designer books and these two are just so special. So I cannot wait to place them somewhere um, as a home decor, you know, I think it's so beautiful. We are home alone with Adele today and I received the packages from Farfetch. I have another collaboration with them uh, for January, which I'm so excited about. That's why I cannot show you what's inside just yet, because there will be a separate unboxing video for that. But oh, I cannot wait to open them. I already have my scissors. And I am uh, watching a Firefly uh, Lane series. I love it so much. Such a good series. But uh, yeah. I just took my makeup off, but we were taking Christmas pictures and it was so much fun. Um, I also put, uh, for the first time ever, I put a, a dress on Adele and uh, I bought it for three months. She's not yet three months, but <laughs> the dress is too small already. I knew she was uh, a big baby, but uh, not that big. I mean, come on. Well, it fit, but uh, you could see that it was very, very tight. Anyway, whatever. We took the photos and uh, we were going to go outside today. We stayed home the entire day because she fell asleep at around 12.50, like one-ish. And she slept for about three and a half hours, which is so unusual for her. Uh, but anyway, she fell asleep at home. By the time she woke up, my husband was back from work. We chilled for a little bit, decided to take these pictures, took them. Uh, we're gonna go on a walk, um, but I saw that Adele was a little bit hungry and so she does not scream outside. I have decided to breastfeed her a little bit um, and so she fell asleep again. <laughs> so we decided to stay in today. I want to do Pilates on the Apple Fitness the Fitness Plus, I think it's called. Um, but anyway, it's gonna be my second time uh, after I gave birth doing sports at home the first time it was a disaster I couldn't do anything this time hopefully um, I'm a little bit stronger I don't know we'll see but I'm also downloading the pictures uh, from my camera and I'll start editing them and hopefully they're good we are going to be taking volley however if you would like to you could take one point out of here I'm all dressed up and ready to start filming um, a farfetch video. This is uh, the look I'll be wearing. I have my earrings from Louis Vuitton, the everyday earrings, um, this Jimmy Choo white t-shirt, H&M cardigan, H&M belt, and cos jeans that I got on sale very recently. By the way, haven't shared what I got, but these jeans is one of the things that I bought on sale, and I really freaking love them. The length is so perfect. Um, I put on a lipstick today and can you see the nails? 
they're not my nails they're not real nails <laughs> um this is so embarrassing but i'm doing a giveaway and i need to film a story um, unboxing you know the celine box and my manicure is not done i don't have time to do it honestly and no desire because with adele changing diapers and all of that of course i want to look pretty but i simply do not have time to do my nails i usually always did it myself in the past every single week i always had my nails done uh now i think i need to go to a salon to get my nails done but i always put it at the back of my head and i keep forgetting to make an appointment that's why i had this pack of uh, press on nails and i've decided to use them this is so not me and usually i would not uh, do something like this because to me it looks so fake and not authentic and i'm all about being real and all of that stuff but my nails were just looking so ugly and i was so embarrassed to do an unboxing a giveaway unboxing with my nails looking like what they did so this was a quick solution i did them in like five minutes or so and that will do but anyway now everybody knows that these nails are fake i don't even know what's more embarrassing have my nails not done or have press on nails <laughs> uh, maybe because i've never done this before it feels wrong and it feels weird but whatever you know sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do hello you guys i want to show you my little christmas corner that i'm just enjoying so much there we've got the nutcrackers i don't know why they are moved but somebody definitely moved them this is so much better and then the setup i shared a post of my mom bringing like a bunch of boxes from baccarat and basically <laughs> here's the unboxing i should do it on instagram as well because a lot of you said yes to the unboxing and then i completely forgot to be honest but my mom got us uh, all of these beautiful pieces from baccarat and there is a candle over there they're very very heavy there are these flowers and then there is this vase for flowers and the exact same thing as on that side they are so freaking beautiful all of these pieces and they're so freaking heavy my mom carried them in a bag how crazy i would never do that only moms can you know sacrifice themselves for their kids i guess because i swear i wouldn't even do it for myself this is the current setup and i think it looks so wonderful it is so lovely i feel like this is where they will stand from now on i used to have um a few picture frames as well as uh this uh, beautiful head over there but uh, now i feel like i'm gonna keep it here and keep those pieces over there and all of this is just so cute and cozy i love it so much and you know i should have used the opportunity of filming reels and taking pictures um while everything is looking so pretty but i'm just so stupid in this way <laughs> uh anyway and then i also wanted to share with you our christmas tree there is a little bit of a mess kind of everywhere because i filmed an unboxing video but here's the tree it is three meters tall um this is the real tree we got this year and all of these beautiful ornaments um i've been collecting since last year pretty much all of them are so very delicate and they were very very pricey so i would say an average price per ornament is around 15 swiss francs so it really depends for example an elephant like this is around 25 francs um, this little guy was around 20 this kind of ribbons uh, were around 10 i would say this uh, one is a gift from my mom and then we've got this little cup it was like 10 and you know all of them are from 10 to 25 swiss francs which is super duper expensive but i always wanted a beautiful tree with beautiful ornaments and to me it's really worth it because new year's and christmas is my most favorite holiday well we celebrate new year's only and i know a lot of you guys celebrate christmas on the 25th of um, december 
uh, we never do actually, <laughs> but uh, we still like the spirit, you know, here, the European spirit uh, of the celebration. And then we have a few of the old ornaments that we used to have for many years now. I still kept them because this tree is so big and uh, my new ornaments just wasn't enough. Uh, then there is this guy, which is so beautiful. But this little ornament is one of my most favorite ones. There is a watermelon one over there. All of them are in glass. This was a gift from a friend, uh, the little fig. This I love, it's so cute. And uh, this one is stunning as well. And I mean, all of them, the Volkswagen one, the chicken. <laughs> Um, oh, this one is an amazing one. It was a gift from my mom as well. And just everything. Oh, I also really love these leaves. So beautiful. There is another one over there. But yes, I just love all of my ornaments. This one, honestly, remind me of Adele. <laughs> it kind of looks like her. And that's so cute. So, um, yeah. The husky one, the goldfish, the llama is very cute. This one is uh, two-sided. Here's the back. And that's so cute as well. Um, this flowers I really, really love. The little squirrel is also very cute. Um, the motorbike, it's um, this one I got for my husband. This was a gift from my mom as well. The caviar, so cool. But uh, yeah, yeah, all of them are very different and I love every single one of them. Hi everyone, it is a Friday before Christmas. And everyone is going crazy in town everyone is buying gifts and there is a lot of queues everywhere it's insane you know to be in town and we went for a walk with Adele she was crying a lot like crazy and we had to go for a walk now she's passed out uh, she's been sleeping for about 40 minutes I think but I got so hungry I got us uh, lunch I was gonna eat it there uh, but I couldn't carry the tray because it's not like a restaurant. It's more like a canteen type of thing uh, at Globus and uh, It was jam-packed with people because once again, everybody is buying gifts. That's why uh, I took it away with me and now I'm going home. It's raining so bad today I'm wearing my rain jacket for the first time because the weather is nice still. It's around 11 12 degrees which is very very warm by the way how are you spending your christmas i know it's christmas when you're watching this video which is so exciting we still don't know what to do the thing is our fridge broke and uh, there is no way i can cook anything because everything will go bad instantly <laughs> so uh, we really don't know what to do we're thinking of going to our friends but we're not sure yet it is a friday we should have a plan by then but usually as i said we don't celebrate christmas and this time of year uh we are back at home but this year we have to stay in geneva because of baby adele she's too tiny to travel this far so we didn't go back home but uh we still need to find a solution to make it work and to have fun i guess we are back home I had lunch finally i was so hungry i'm already ironing over there and uh, adele is sleeping outside she's so cute the good thing is that we have uh, an electric um, uh, pram uh, which uh, you know is such a lifesaver because i just turn it on <laughs> so there is an effect of uh, the pram moving a little bit and it keeps her asleep and it's been like one and a half hours already probably she's still asleep which is amazing so there she is on a balcony and that's so amazing i'm pretty sure people on the street are thinking what the hell is that and i also filmed the unboxing for farfetch that will be up um early january i know it's not anytime soon but this is how 
usually partnerships work and uh, collaborations work and sponsorships work you have to do everything in advance since it's christmas eve i put on my festive socks with a little bit of glitter but this is basically what i am wearing today i have my laura piano uh, white soles the winter edition uh, cos jeans here is my new coat from totem I haven't unboxed it yet but i filmed the video which i will be posting um a bit later and uh, then i have this uh, very thin knit um, it's actually my husband's i don't even know what the brand name is uh, but he didn't want it anymore and i tried it on it fit me well and i've decided to keep it i'm wearing my new uh, by alana chain necklace which is so freaking cool in silver and i have my graph earrings uh they're from the keys collection i'm not sure if it is focused yes there you go they're so freaking fabulous and my 19 bag in this beautiful um, gray color as well so what do you guys think of my today's outfit i think it's a very very cute it is super warm outside it's around 15 degrees and yeah, i'm so excited for today hi everyone we are on a walk we are actually going uh, to a close by town to a center uh, to get a few things from there because there is the store in Geneva but my husband he just doesn't like it uh, so he prefers the other one because we used to live there so we're now walking for a little bit with Adele uh, waiting for my husband because uh, there is a few things he needs to finish she's such a sweetheart such a cute little pie wants to sleep so I'm waiting for her to fall asleep so we can drive you know calmly but today is the 24th it's the christmas eve tonight uh yeah <laughs> we're not celebrating once again but everybody is and it makes me feel so festive as well uh yeah love 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 this winter holidays here with Adele. We just changed her nappy. Uh, she's all cleaned up, but I'm gonna end this vlog here. Merry Christmas, you guys. I'm really hoping that all of your wishes will come true, that you're having an amazing day today, that you're spending it or with your loved ones. Anyway, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!